Well, it's pretty nice today. Even rolled the windows down in the truck today is driving around town with those high temperatures today getting into the upper 40s and some lower 50s. Very comfortable outside. The warmest we've been in about 12 days. We're kind of stuck in those low 30s and upper 20s. We had a consistent stretch of below freezing type temperatures even for highs. But today, nothing like that. Well above average 10 degrees above average today in Rochester. We're at 50 in Austin, 52 through Mason City, 54 today in Charles City. Temperatures will be this warm tomorrow. Still, though, potentially above average for Thanksgiving. What can we expect for the forecast tomorrow for the holiday? Some overcast skies, maybe some patchy fog, some drizzle will be possible through the afternoon and evening. Black Friday mild, we'll have some sunshine then on Black Friday, probably closer to the mid 40s, both Friday and then once again on the Saturday, we can take a little bit of a dip on Sunday, but still overall pretty comfortable and quiet this upcoming weekend. Lewis not a live camera temperatures outside. We're at 39, some mainly clear skies. We'll have some high level clouds on the way later on tonight. Winds are out of the southeast, currently at 10 miles per hour, so it feels a little colder outside right at about 32 at this hour. Temperatures low 30s Winona. We're at 39 currently in La Crosse. I 35 low 40 still 43 through Owatonna, Albert Lee, Austin 40 right now in Mason City. Future track radar talked about it tonight a little warmer. Well, we have some cloud cover, so cloud deck moves in, allows the surface to stay warm. We are tracking a cold front. Now this cold front is fairly dry, but maybe a couple chances for some drizzle spots and even some fog could develop along that front as it starts to move in. So watch here. So we're at six o'clock tonight. Cold front off uh, to our north northwest temperatures tomorrow morning. So not too bad. We're probably in the low 40s and notice just a little bit of a wintry mix right along that front. We're at 43, 28 in Fargo, so all that cold air then starts to move in pretty much just for Thanksgiving. So we're dropping those temperatures down. So we start before noon in the 40s. After that 12 o'clock hour, we're probably down into the 30s for the rest of the afternoon. So Thanksgiving forecast, high temperatures, low 40s. We hit that in the morning and we'll drop those temperatures down by probably 3, 4 o'clock. We're closer to around the freezing point. Some light flurries and even a couple sprinkles will be possible through the afternoon as that front moves in. So watch temperatures tonight, still in the low 40s, upper 30s. Here comes that frontal boundary along with it. A little bit of a wintry mix. It'll be fairly quick. Uh, no accumulation expected coming up tomorrow, whether that be rain or snow. No. Temperatures dropping then through the afternoon. We should stay pretty steady in the upper 20s for those overnight lows. Friday rolls around. We clear those skies out and those high temperatures could return to the upper 40s once again. So our precip chances upcoming weekend were dry all the way Friday extending into Monday. Just a couple straight chances for some drizzle spots coming up on Thursday. Then we're tracking that next system that could impact the upper Midwest Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. Tonight overnight lows at 35. Winds will stay out of the south. Tomorrow winds will be out of the south and then out of the north. That's why we drop those temperatures down throughout the day. 40 for the high couple spots there for some patchy fog throughout the day. So some drizzle spots tomorrow and then we'll see some sunshine coming up Friday and Saturday. High temperatures returning to maybe the upper 40s both those two days. Mark.